Sorry. And these mirrors are everywhere. They're on buses, in the front of a bus, so that they don't run over yeah. school children. They'll be in, a, in the nook of a um, uh, like an entryway where you can't see through a corner, so you look and you can see if there's someone hiding there. And I thought to myself, you know, what do what do people today think about in, in an urban environment? They're scared. They're, then you know, these are about one mirror is about safety. A few is about being extra safe. Hundreds of them is about you know paranoia. But that was that original work. This work has gone beyond that and it's gone to a whole different direction, which is this whole theme of, you know, children fairy tale and um, how people become different. Eine gelungene und aufwendige und zugleich spannende, weil aktive Kunst- und Kulturvermittelnde Aktion des Künstlerpaares Emilia und Ilya Kabakov. I don't speak very good English, but I have very much pleasure. They stay the ship here on the sea and the, ich weiß nicht, was Spiegel auf Englisch heißt. Okay, they are here. Okay, thank you. There is a tradition of children's fairy tales that start with once upon a time, then there's a story, and they end with they live happily ever after. And this is across all cultures. It's something that's organically uh, generated. It's not a tradition, a European tradition that's been sent elsewhere. And I was fascinated by this, that children from around the world grow up in such a similar kind of environment, and then unfortunately they seem to diverge. And how is it that we can grow up to be so intolerant? And to me, mirrors here represent hope. When you stand in the circle, it's kind of like a fairy circle. The, the many reflections, millions of reflections that you see of yourself, your neighbors, the surroundings, symbolize the many ways that we can make tolerance work. So thank you very much. I very much appreciate this opportunity. I hope you like the work I've put here. I, I know you're all you know, amazed by the ship of tolerance.